Welcome to the Unit 18 review. While most uh, gas stations offer basic commodities such as beverages, tobaccos, and junk foods, the Isa Brothers outfitted theirs with high-end convenience stores offering all kinds of uh, appealing fresh foods. They partnered with fast food restaurants such as Burger King and even brought the first drive through Starbucks to the UK. With their success, they quickly upgraded and now, to this day, they have about 400 locations in the UK, as well as almost 2,000 in the United States. There are some concerns, however. With their newly acquired stores in the US, uh, they have upgraded those stores, but many of them lack the appropriate space to become viable uh, grocery store alternatives. It's also unclear whether American consumers will buy into the idea of doing a shop whilst filling up their gas tanks. Uh, most Americans regard gas stations as slightly creepy places where one is best off not hanging around too long, filling up, paying at the pump and moving on. Um, on top of this, EG has acquired a lot of personal debt, uh, worrisome debt even, uh, with their acquisitions of large supermarket chains such as Asda and Kroger. Creepy. Creepy. Will these leverage bets pay off? Uh, who knows? The question now is whether their vision of markets farther afield will prove equally apt. Leveraged. Leveraged. Farther afield. Farther afield. Apt. Apt. Visiting gas stations, uh, like I mentioned, sometimes I like to buy snacks and things. Mm -hmm. uh, but there is some information that suggests that many people like to splurge most on beverages and food. Uh -huh. Why do you think that is? Splurge. Splurge. Food can be a boring experience, <laughs> a nice experience, an amazing experience. It can be the highlight of your day. No <laughs> one's highlight is ever going to be um, filling up your gas tank. Yeah. Um, and there's no way of jazzing that experience up, mm. you know? So, uh, yeah, we like to splurge on things that are nice, whether it's a hotel room mm. or a, a five-star Michelin meal mm. um, or, I don't know, a wonderful haircut. Yeah. Um, you know, yeah. if, if it's nice, you pay extra for it, right? Right. What are some of the things that you typically splurge on? You know, something I can buy, like a nice camera or mm. something like that. Yeah. What about you? Yeah. Yeah, me too, sometimes, uh, electronics. Um, I think I tend to, I don't know if it's splurging, but I tend to splurge on shopping. Like, I wait for many months mm -hmm. and then go and shop for a lot of things all at once. Okay. Clothing or shoes. Mm -hmm. uh, but food also. Mm -hmm. Every now and then, a nice meal is just, it makes you happy, right? Absolutely. <laughs> Very good. Okay, well, that'll do it for Unit 18. We'll see you guys back for the next one. Take care.